Hi, I'm Sophie, the Marketing Events and Campaigns Officer here at WCG. As part of open events, we're trying really hard to improve accessibility. This includes putting tape lines on the floor, so wayfinding around our sites is much easier. As well as this, we printed large-scale maps and highlighted key aspects like designated quiet rooms. One action we've taken to become more inclusive is to buy an old grammar school and bring it back into purposeful use as an accessible dental centre. So really easy to access. We have a bariatric chair, which doubles as a wheelchair tipper. You can go straight into a surgery environment, all kitted out for the needs of our patients. We have the most wonderful accessible reception area with screens, access to the dental surgeries, and we even have braille on our signs. We've also added Recite Me to our websites. One way the National Health Council is inclusive is by emboldening our patients and patient advocates to be included in diverse conversations and opportunities to enhance our research, our research methodologies and studies to improve health outcomes and optimize patient health. At Papyrus Prevention of Young Suicide, we work with an organization called Language Line. Language Line allows us to support people who may not speak English as a first language through our Suicide Prevention Helpline, Hopeline 24-7. One thing we have done as an organization to be more inclusive was install the language and accessibility tool through Recite Me on our website. This allows everyone, including those whose primary language is not English, and those with disabilities to more easily navigate and access our content. The tool includes a screen reader, the ability to change font sizes and colors, and just an easier tool for them to switch to their primary language. So we are so excited to have this accessibility and language tool on our website. Uh, one action we have taken to become more inclusive is our focus across the organisation on accessibility. Uh, back in 2021, we agreed minimum standards for digital accessibility and we have supported our staff to um, embed this uh, through training, providing them with the tools necessary to do it. One such tool is the Recite Me Accessibility Toolbar, which is on our website. And we're really pleased to see that regularly gets used by users so that they can personalise how they read the website and view the website and, and access our materials. We know that this is um, just one of many actions we do, but it's also a journey that we are committed to keep progressing the inclusivity and accessibility of our website, communications and services. In order to improve inclusivity at the hospice, we have set up equality tea talks for our colleagues where they can join and discuss their lived experience, their upbringing and things that they would like to learn about different cultures and perspectives. It's based on the nine protected characteristics and we've seen a real significant interest in those learning that bit more. A key focus of the Humane Society for Tacoma and Pierce County's three-year strategic plan is fostering impactful relationships with the communities we serve. To advance these efforts beyond our shelter walls, we've created an inclusive digital experience by incorporating Recite Me's accessibility toolbar on our website. Now, visitors can view and use our website in a way that works best for them. We at the NWG Network have become more inclusive by introducing Recite accessibility tools to our website. These include changing color themes that suit the user, translating the website into over 100 different languages, as well as the ability for the user to download information as an audio file. This has supported our organization to create a more inclusive environment.